All right, what's up guys? So today, I'm out here kayaking and I'm having a hell of a time getting out of these mangroves that I somehow found myself into. And it's taken quite a bit of resilience for me to get out of here because I've been in this mess for about an hour now and my arms are exhausted, but I'm not gonna quit. I'm gonna keep going because eventually, if I just keep going and keep trying to figure out <laughs> exactly where I am, I'll eventually get out of these mangroves and I'll be able to go back home and have a beer. And I will achieve victory and not let the failure get the best of me. So, I thought to get my mind off of it a little bit and to get something out of this mess that I would make a video for you guys about the importance of overcoming challenges and not letting failure get the best of you all right especially for you soldiers out there it's extremely important all too often am i seeing uh soldiers nowadays and no i'm not trying to you know offend anybody here but all too often am i seeing soldiers nowadays just give up way too quickly make up excuses for reasons why they can't do something or just not have a goal in general and that i'm just you know putting it out there is not the way you should be living your life you always want to have a goal you always want to have a challenge set in front of you don't just be living you know have have something that you want to go do have something that you want to go achieve and try to achieve it once you figure out what your goal is whatever it may be whether it be a school you want to go to or some sort of career enhancement opportunity like you know maybe going green to gold or going to a specialized unit going to a selection something like that going to another unit that you've always dreamed of serving under it's totally possible to do these things um i don't care what your commanders say i don't you know i don't care what your nco says i don't care what your buddies are saying there's always a way to get out of the army what you want to get out of it. And honestly, there's nothing wrong with that. When you um, when you get what you want out of the army, out of the military, you inherently, in most cases, like 98% of cases, you inherently become a better asset for that organization. You become a better soldier for the army because you are in a place, you are in a position um, or you have some sort of accomplishment under your belt that you've wanted to do. So you become a more motivated, better trained, and better educated soldier. Which in turn, if you do your job the right way, will, will um, bleed into and rub off on other soldiers that you come in contact, making the army better as a whole. So you're a better asset if you get what you want out of the army. It's a fact. And all you leaders watching this need to understand that. It's true. So don't ever be afraid to, I want you to go out there and find yourself a challenge. I don't care what kind of soldier you are. I don't care if you're a combat MOS or not. Find yourself a challenge, man. I'm, I'm here to tell you there's so many different challenges out there. There's so many different opportunities in the army. I mean, and it's all doable. Don't listen to your to your buddies, man, if they're negative. If if you have buddies that you're telling that you you have a dream to go to ranger school or you have a dream to become an officer one day, maybe you want to go join special operations, don't let anybody take you away from uh, that dream, that goal, okay? You need to go full force into whatever it is that you're trying to accomplish and don't look back. Anytime somebody has anything negative to say, just ignore it. Don't even argue with them. Don't, don't tell them why they're wrong. Just ignore it and move on. Find, surround yourself by people that actually want to accomplish things. Surround yourself with the buddies that want the same goals as you. Train with them. If it's something that you need to get physically prepared for, that's who you need to be training up with so that you challenge each other and remind each other how hard you need to work. If you're trying to get um, a little smarter, do something that requires a little more brains, you know, maybe you're trying to go to college or something like that. Find people that want 
those kinds of goals and you'll learn from each other you'll learn from each other you'll learn from each other's failures and you'll be better for it in the end it's only going to make you better don't stagnate don't stagnate um during your career and get nothing out of it you know you're not doing anybody any favors doing that and you're not taking full advantage of what you could be having look at that little tiny turtle <laughs> brand new turtle find yourself a goal and surround yourself by people that want to help you reach that goal just like i'm paddling through these mangroves i'm tired my arms are whooped i don't have any more water i'm sucking but if i just keep paddling and i keep having that drive and i keep trying the different paths to success i'll eventually figure out the right one and i'll eventually get to my path that leads me to success and i'll get out of these fucking mangroves i want you to do the same thing with your career find your path to success do not listen to the naysayers find the uh, people that have similar goals as you or at least are on your side about it and are rooting for you and go for it man go for it and anytime you fail if you you know if you go to aerosol school and you fail at aerosol just take it as a lesson learned go back go back to school um it's okay failure is a good thing you learn from failure you learn from your mistakes you will learn what not to do <laughs> when you go and you fail at something you're gonna learn that's the the one guaranteed takeaway from failure is that you have learned another thing of what not to do so there's always a takeaway from failure man failure in the end always equals growth and you should look at it as an opportunity to learn and an opportunity to grow better. And seriously, man, whatever your goal is, you can do it. You can do it. I'm here to tell you, especially in the army, man, that you can do it. All those goals are totally attainable. Everything in the army is attainable. You just got to put in the work to make it happen. And don't listen. If there's packets that require standards that you're not making that you're not meeting then go out there and, and fix it so that you are meeting those requirements if your ASVAB score isn't uh, high enough then go study for the ASVAB and take it again okay don't let that be an excuse don't say oh well I don't have a high enough ASVAB score so I guess I'm just not gonna go uh, be a ranger now or I guess I'm just not gonna go to SF or I'm not gonna be an officer well dude all you gotta do is go retake the test you know what I did? I didn't have a high, I had a 109 when I came in, one shy of the magic number. <clears throat> and so when I wanted to be an officer, I just went and retook the ASVAD, didn't even study or nothing, and I ended up with a 121, okay? And I didn't do anything special or like go to school or anything. So like, it's totally doable. I'm not saying you should do it that way, but I'm just saying it is totally doable, okay? Um, don't waste any time. Don't waste any time at all. You only have so much time and you don't know when your time is up. So get to work. All the goals, all the all the things that you want to achieve uh, during your career, go get it, man. The time is now. All right. Figure it out. Start figuring it out. Putting your put your work in on figuring it out. Get with the right people. Get the right contacts and fill out the paperwork, man. And start working out right. Do it now and don't wait. Because you never know when that opportunity is gonna go away. Seize the moment, man. Seize the moment. Look, even if you're the guy, and I doubt this, especially for you Army guys, even if you're the guy that has nobody on your side, or girl, even if you're the gal that has nobody on her side, know this. I am on your side. I want you to succeed, okay? I want you to do great things so you at least have me here rooting for you trying to make it through 
this kayaking experience, which I will make through. I don't think you're gonna get to see it because my battery is gonna die. But I'm gonna make it through, don't you worry. Because I got the fortitude and the grit to make it happen. You need to have the same mindset with your goals. Have the fortitude, the grit, and the resilience to push past all the naysayers and all the negativity that surrounds your goals. Push past that, meet the challenge, and achieve success. Do it for yourself.